Shout out Kaka, everybody. Shout out Kaka. What's happening? What's happening? I guess you're saying, so what do you got standing beside you now? I got a new girl. Her name is... Wow, well, she don't have a name yet. You want me to give you a name, girl? I'll give you a name. Uh, Olympic. <laughs> and I'm going to take this off your hair. She got a hair rag on. So I'm going to take her hair rag off. Throw it over there. I'm going to name you Olympic, girl. Olympic. And that's what it is, folks. Check it out. This is, this is the new Olympic. All right, so this is called the Persuader. So let me tell you what's, what's all about this bass right now. This is the volume, right? There's no push and pull, just volume. And this is another volume. This is the rear pickup. This is the front pickup. This is the bass and treble. Very simple. Neck through. Absolutely beautiful. Look at it. Oh, my God. I changed the tuners. It had got off tuners on it, and I put a Grover's. Very thick Grover's. And I guess you're asking, why did you do that, man? Why did you take the Grover's off? Easy. Why did I take them off? Because I wanted to. Thank you, here. Thank you, here. All right, so here we go. Now, let me explain this bass, and I'm not going to take long doing it. The Olympic bass is a very unique bass. Everybody knows the Olympic bass through Stanley Clark. Okay, he's not the only one, but he's the one that mostly everybody see Olympics in their hands. Olympic bass is a very unique bass. I don't think they are acquired taste. I think I think they are they are very expensive and very well made. And if that's an acquired taste for you, go for it. You the man. You the woman. All right, so check it out. All right, so this bass has a brass nut on the top, and it has brass. You know, on the uh, for the bridge and the saddles and stuff like that, and it's got a PJ setup. All right, got a set of pick, a set of P's, and a J in the back, and the J is all the way to the rear where the saddle is, which gives that very staccato. But there's a there's a con on this too. The con is, from what I've seen on YouTube, is that guys are complaining that the rear pickup is not loud enough, and I agree. I think the rear pickup should be louder. But, you know, Olympic knew what they was doing when they did it. And I didn't. I wasn't there when they put it together. Because I would have told them. Like, turn that rear pickup up. Okay? Thank you, him. All right, so, but I, didn't, I wasn't there, so I couldn't tell them. So, but you can tell them. If you know them, call them. It ain't going to make a difference. Because this is early 80s, I think it is. Might be early 90s. I don't know. I didn't check. I will, though. All right, so check it out. So here we go. Rear pickup first. And we're going to do all bass. Now, another thing about the Olympic, this particular bass, is that it has a paramedic EQ. And you're like, paramedic? What does that mean? Does somebody, they drive a truck and they come pick up the sink? No, man. That ain't what that means. No. All right, so it has this, this special kind of EQ, right? And the EQ does a, amazing things. Check this out. So I'm going to turn the rear pickup on first. You know, the one that ain't loud enough. And then we're going we're gonna to do this. Watch this. It's got a monster in it. Wow, wow. But check this out, though. All right, let's turn the front on so you can really hear it. Check this out. It means it just goes right through all the settings. It just, it just clearly just puts you where you need to be. I mean, it's, this bass has so much quality as far as tone. It's unbelievable. But you have to get it, play it, to hear it. I'm not going to be able to tell you within three minutes or four minutes of what this bass can particularly do. All right? I'm going to miss some stuff. So you got to get you one and figure out. And those who already got one, you know what up, baby. You know what up. All right, so here we go. Here we go. All right, so let's go through the rear pickup first and all bass. Now, the thing about this bass here, uh, when it takes it all bass, when I say milky bottom, this thing has a milky satin bottom. That's the rear. Check out the front. And it is set right. I got it so low, it's underneath the frets. Thank you, yeah. So let's go rear pickup, same thing. 
You hear the volume go down a little bit? And you're like, I wonder what amp he's coming through. Aguilar GS, baby, 112. And a um, GK 500, baby. MB 500. I'm a GK man. I'm a, I'm a definitely Aguilar man. Uh, <clears throat> so, okay. So, let's go both pickups on bass and you get this. Okay. Now, we're going to go detent on the tone. Check it out. That would be about detent. Now, it doesn't have a detent notch nowhere, so you have to actually listen for it. But it has so many tones, you kind of can miss it and kind of can get it. You just have to have the bass and keep playing to find out. Rear pick up first. Now, you can get some serious Jocko stuff out of this, man. Okay. Rear pick up. I mean, front pick up. You hear the difference in the in the in the uh, the height of the pickup? Of course. Okay, both pickups on D10. So smooth, man. So milky. So smooth. Now, if you take it all the way, you hear that? That's both pickups wide open. Check it out. If I take that front pickup and pull it back five hairs, you get a different sound. Check it out. If I take it up one more hair up, you hear it? Another hair up. Another hair up. Another hair up. Another hair up. Full wide open. Okay. And I'm telling you, I'm not going to go through all the way through this bass because you have to sit home with it and actually go through all the tonations of this bass. But the, the quality of this bass makes it cost what it costs. All right, the Olympic name, they have to stand behind their name. So the quality in this bass is unbelievable. It's untouched. It is Olympic. All I got to say about this bass, is that you bad girl? You a bad girl. It's got a brass nut. You see that? Brass nut. And the nut is adjustable. I don't know what else to say about you, but, uh, I think I like you a lot, a lot, a lot. <laughs> Johnny Lee Long. Peace.